Good morning, good morning. It is Bahamas Derby Day. On our way to the event, it is what? 172 steps from our bedroom. Very excited though. We've got like 35 competitors, so this could truly be anyone's derby. Also, you might win. You watching this, you might win. Here, the other thing to know, and we'll show this in a sec, no fence yet, as far as we can tell. It might be an honor system home run derby, uh, but the show must go on. Welcome, gonna be a heck of a day. All right, here is the layout for the Derby. This is the hitting platform. This is the very short walkway to where the pitcher is gonna stand. I would probably say this is about 20 feet, definitely shorter than what you would normally see during batting practice. Then if we turn around here, we'll see the outfield, put that in quotes. So that boundary over there, that red line, that's the fence. They're currently setting the fence up. I would probably say from home plate, it's about 300 feet, maybe a little bit shorter. Pretty incredible setup. That's the beach, that's the ocean, that's home plate. Crowd showing up, it's gonna be sweet. If you get to the staging area, if you're not a participant, you need to clear the staging area. Now we do, baby, it's New York City, Brooklyn in the building. All right, moments before the start of the derby, we got all the players lined up. Getting loose, getting ready to go right here in Jordan. Now is the time. Official picks. Who you got? 2021 Dope Like Home Run Derby champion will be? I'm saying Lewis Brinson. We had both. We have history of repeats of this uh, competition. Bo Bichette did it uh, in the first few. I think Lewis Brinson is defending his crown today. Lucius Fox, who finished second last time. I know I'm wearing the Isaacs jersey and you're a Lucius Fox, but I'm going to go with Lou. Finally bring home the crown. Be the first Bahamian to win the Derby on home soil. Let's see what happens. All right, so uh, it just started absolutely pouring. You can't really see it because it's Still look kind of like looks nice, but if you look this way, the tropical torrential downpour is underway. So the derby is on a delay. The big issue here is that we might be running out of daylight. So uh, things could get a little interesting.
All right, Jordan, the 2021 Home Run Derby in the Bahamas is officially over. Our yes. champion, MJ Melendez. What a shock. The guy that hit 41 homers <laughs> led the minors. Whoa! It's crazy. Very impressive. Yeah. First round especially. They were to dead center. Right down they the middle. They were just bam. But he was launching them straight away center. Water. I was impressed with him, but also the defending champ, Lewis Brinson. He was automatic again. He was, he was, especially I mean, that first round, my goodness. I, and I picked him, I thought he was gonna come through, fell a little bit short at the end, and then Jazz, of course, also one of the last finalists, put on a show. That was the thing, dude. Jazz didn't win, still no Bahamians ever won. But the thing is, like, he was the loudest cheers. Yep. People stuck around through the rain yep. to wait to see him hit. I would say he delivered. Absolutely. My favorite moment of the night was he swung so hard, his chain snapped, <laughs> and then he put it on the ground, and then he hit seven home runs, Ooh, and he forgot about it. Yeah, well, he just left it behind. I had to pick it up and deliver it. I to saw. Him personally, yeah, just jazz things, just jazz things. But as usual, our second time here in paradise does it spectacular. Oh. It is getting a little dark. Obviously, the rain delay pushed things a little bit back, but we got the derby in. Yep. We got a worthy champion in MJ Melendez. 100. percent And uh, we had a great time. Uh, Pete Alonzo. Consider this a challenge. Oh, Derby King. Come on. Come but can he do it on a sunny afternoon in the Bahamas, Jordan? 